to all my good student, bad student, young student, old student. This video I will show you how to determine a platform heading. I received few inquiries lately asking how to place a jackup rig on the platform. Okay, so it's very simple. I'm not especially in Malaysia. Okay, uh, as you know, we always have a northeast monsoon, which is pretty rough weather. So for a jackup rig, how are you gonna place a jackup rig, right, on the platform? Okay, so normally you have to design in such a way. If let's say you have a new platform, you're gonna install, it, but you must ensure that this platform is going to drill by a jackup. If you use other rig, then it's not applicable anymore in this video. Okay, so jackup rig normally there is a crane on the port side, one here and the other one here. Okay, and they have one crane on the starboard side. The platform heading you should set at the northwesterly heading. So the reason is if you have a rough weather from the northeast monsoon, where it's normally coming from this way, right? So during the operation, we don't talk about rig move yet, we talk about operation, drilling operation. If you have a bad weather coming over here, of course it's too bad then it's very rough then you cannot have a vessel to come in alongside and do your cargo operation here. Yeah? So then in this way, your vessel will always come from the port side of the rig and stand by here, right? And then this is the weather coming from here. So if the vessel have an engine failure or for any reason, in this way, the weather will push away the vessel away from the rig. Instead of you will put the vessel here, the vessel will come straight to the rig. Okay. So another reason is jackup rig. Normally there is two cranes on the port side. Just in case one crane is not working for some reason and you still have another alternative crane to work on the supply boat. So it's a win-win situation if you can set the jackup rig heading to 315, right? then this will be good during the monsoon season. So after the monsoon, actually there is no requirement for the rig heading because yeah, they say there is some southwest monsoon effect in this part. It's not really a prolonged period, you know, it just come occasionally but it's not really important during the non-monsoon season. So on the other hand, if you set the heading in such a way, right, and you, you anticipate a jackup rig will come in to do the job for you, okay. So you must have a boat landing on this side, this side, preferably on this side as well. So same thing, you know, when they come for a, a crew change, you know, at least they, they have on either side they have a lead, right? So the boat can choose either way, the rim monsoon or normal monsoon, so they can come in safely. You know? So that that is when if the brig is finished with drilling and they're gone, you know, at least when they are stand alone, at least they have a leeway on, on this side and the monsoon. So in this way it's good and you can actually plan for your platform for the heading of 315. So this is the ideal brick heading yeah, for a jackup. Okay. So even if you plan for exploration well yeah, you take away the, the platform. So they just stand alone. Same thing you know so this is the preferred heading that you need to set the rig. Okay, if you want to set the rig heading the other way around, which is south easterly, you can do that as well. So, in uh, that, I mean, I'm talking about the uh, during the uh, uh, monsoon season as well. So, the disadvantage, as I say, you don't have if you turn the rig around for expression well, meaning to say you don't have two cranes on the port and stubble crane. But you still can work just use a stubble crane. But in case stubble crane is down, then you will not benefit the operator. So they have to wait and possible this is not safe to come in if you turn the rig the other way around. So the best heading in Malaysia, I would say is 315 degree. 
through North Hill. Okay, I hope you learn. And if you have any question or anything to ask me, by all means, please comment below. I will answer you whenever I'm available. Thank you for watching the video.